Hi folks, Jason Clemens from Clemens Boats in Sandusky, Ohio. This is our Boston Whaler 200 Dauntless. It's sitting on a Venture Tandem Axle trailer. It can be sold with or without the trailer or with a different trailer. This is an I-beam aluminum trailer. It does have disc brakes. Nice high bow rail. This is the updated Boston Whaler hull. Nice big smirk, keeps you very dry, very quiet ride. Of course, unsinkable. This boat has a 200 Verado for power. This is an I-4 Verado. So not only is it very good on fuel, and it's uh, got a lot of power, but it's lighter. So the fuel economy is very good. Um, you get a little extra power out of it than uh, a, a straight six or a V6. There's some of the dimensions on the boat. Notice the swamp capacity on there. Whaler's the only one that does that. Nice deep reach boarding ladder. Three steps, very easy to get in and out. Bear with me for a second here so I can climb up. This boat has the sun top, that's the factory top. As you can see with boot, it has the nice bimini top mounts, which are the ball socket mounts. You don't need any tools for that. It's a push pin design, very quiet. As you can see, I'm shaking it. You don't hear anything. It's got Teflon uh, coating inside. Nice big bow cushion. There is a filler available for this boat. Small thing, but there are cup holders on the corners, which is nice to have. Anchor locker on the front. Notice the gas assist arm. It's a small thing, but it's awful nice to have when you're out in two footers and the boat's rolling around and you have to try to keep this open on your own. With this, it stays open on its own. You don't have to mess with it. This is very good used as a cooler as well. Being that whalers are all foam filled, the insulation really helps keep ice uh, from melting so you can keep things a lot longer. Very thick hatch, as you can see, approximately an inch thick. So it's gonna last. You can walk on top of it, it doesn't bow under, under your weight. Seat in the front of the console here, there's a live well underneath this. As you can see, also small thing, but it does have the exist arm on it. So if you're trying to get bait out of here, you don't have to hold the lid up the whole time, it's gonna do it for you. Rod holders on each side. Reversible pilot seat here. We'll face forward and aft. So if you have somebody skiing, somebody can stand up and have a spotter to watch the skier. If you're fishing and you want to face the stern, you can. Here is the console on the 200 Dauntless. Digital throttle and shift, which is standard on Verados. So it's a fly-by-wire system, very smooth. Trim tab switch with indicators. Again, a small thing, but most companies don't have that. It's a standard switch. You have to guess where you're at. Smartcraft gauges, so you've got analog and digital gauges. It gives you all of your, basically your engine stats, anything from water temperature, oil temperature, fuel capacity, fuel flow meter, um, many different functions in there. Compass is standard. This has the Clarion CD player on it, which is inside the console. I'll show you in a second. One other nice thing about this boat is it has a head in the console. You see it has a small magnet down there to hold the door open. Again, a small thing, but it's nice to have when you're out running the boat. You don't have to worry about uh, holding the door open. Porta pot in the center console. The console is fairly good size. You can store a lot of gear in here. And then here's the CD player. Does have a seat and console cover, which you can see underneath there. And on to the biggest seller of this boat. 
the big stern seat in the back section. In years past, they've had this seating design, but they didn't have the arms on it. They used a little friction point. This is much better. It stays up easier. It's easier to lift up because you get a little help because again, this is very thick. But that's nice because when you lay it down, you, you can stand on it easy. There's also a lot of storage under here. There's one side and then there's both. So you've got a spot for skis, fishing poles, you know, lots of equipment. And then you can set this down and then you've got much more space in the bag. You have a platform you can fish off of, lots of room, um, but also lots of seating and it's deep. So for younger kids, it's nice to have. If you have any questions on this boat, you can give us a call at 419-684-5365. You can email us at clemensboats.com. And don't forget to like us on Facebook. Thanks.